Today I would like to speak about something that is very dear to my heart and I believe, I feel it's of utmost importance to the survival of humanity, to our evolution as community, as species. Well, it is quite visible today that our men have been incrementally and systematically targeted. Human men. And, you know, it is hard to comprehend what's happening unless you take a look at this situation from a meta perspective, from above. So imagine, imagine you are an alien species, yeah? And imagine you would like to conquer this beautiful, pla this beautiful plane, the, the earth. If, imagine you would like to enslave the people. You would like to have, you would like to have access to their women and children. Who stands on the way? Men. And we can see that our alpha male has been targeted, mocked, put down, and systematically, incrementally poisoned, brainwashed, sidetracked through porn, through all sorts of, you know, junk food, alcohol. Yes, destroyed. Our men have been systematically destroyed. And also what's happening recently is that we can see that women have been weaponized against men. So um, if you look at what's really, really happening in terms of human species, you cannot comprehend that behavior because why would a human female attack human male, right? But if you look at from above perspective, from that assuming that this energy that is attacking our men is alien, yeah, you could almost say it is demonic. And a lot of people nowadays speak about narcissists, that, you know, narcissists are acting weird in relationships and selfish and manipulative and, you know, throwing all sorts of drama and guilt, blame, shame. Well, what if this is not narcissist? What if it is actually a demonic energy? Yes, what if they are actually demons? And particularly there is, you know, there is a, there is a female demon, it is called succubus, right? Um, and that female demon can occur very seductive. It is that woman in the red dress, Neo, that walks in front of you. But when you actually turn around and turn around again and not look at, not, not just look at her boobs and ass, but you look through, you might actually see Agent Smith inside there. Yeah. So I'm recording this, this message, first of all, to raise awareness among men so you will be discerning and vigilant and look through and another thing is that i feel i'm calling upon women also to stand up and defend our men because who is going to protect us who is going to defend our our uh, our families our communities if not men who is going to build stuff for us if not men let's get real yeah, they 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 are right now we need leaders to arise and men are born to lead. They are naturally born to make decisions in 3D plane. They are more logical, rational, and they enjoy it. They enjoy making decisions. We women can chill and relax when they, when they go ahead and make important decisions. Yeah, of course, women want to be heard and women, women want to guide men, but it takes a woman to be able to do this. A demon is not going to be a source of guidance to a man. A demon is not going to be a source of power to a man, a source of inspiration. So look through, discern, and stand up for men. But they are our brothers, you know? And um, if you are a man listening to this, to this video and you feel like you need help to walk away from some kind of a some kind of a succubus that is draining your life force then and you need you need empower you need inspiration you need someone to hold you you know guide you hold the light for you and guide you like light in the tunnel yeah through the process of you know breakup separation and so on then i'm here to hold your hand i'm here to to, to hold the light for you so do not hesitate contact me email me there is a link in my profile and also, I would like to invite you to a retreat for men 
for men's empowerment that uh, I am launching here in beautiful Illyrian lands in beautiful Albania with outdoor fitness and lots of stuff to boost your testosterone because now is the time when you need to have courage. Real women do not fall for money. Real women do not fall for a big penis. We really don't care. Real women fall for courage and they will follow you. If you have courage, a real woman will follow you. A demon, if you have courage, is gonna sabotage you. All right, so be aware. All right, that's it for now. I hope it clears something for you. Look through, do not look at.